hello guys so hope so you all are doing well and today i will talk about open ai and uh, gpt3 and how you can create your content with the help of gpt3 and open ai so like what is open ai so open ai open ai is you can say a research laboratory deployment uh, like which which gives you insights about you know the research and deployment and uh, what like what is gpt3 so gpt3 is uh, pretend transformer uh, which generative pretend transformer which which can be used for you know text generation so like today i will show you how you can generate email with the help of open ai uh, for example let's say if you are give if you uh, add some keywords and then after if you want to generate an email so how it can be and how it look like to be a professional email so for this uh, like you can simply type on google as email generation and open ai so this is like gpt3 so firstly if you are not uh, registered yourself in gpt3 or open ai uh, open ai so firstly you need to create an account in open ai and you need to uh, create an uh, private key for this so and then after you can use open ai so this is the one of the reference video from youtube where you can uh, generate email uh, like professional email as well as the casual email so uh, like i'm working uh, on this as a reference uh, from this video and I'm, uh, like i've take uh, like i've you know take reference from this video and uh, parallelly i have also worked on this uh, similarly you can also find this as is on github likewise if you in this video we're going to be if you click on this so it might be you know you, you it help you to get the uh, you know the github video and github code so uh, like i am just using this uh, for email generation so i have already cloned this model uh, into my local directory and this is the you know the model setup uh, and i have created virtual environment for this so now i'm opening my terminal so uh, it's look like this and i have also uh, activate my virtual environment uh, through source dot slash env slash bin slash activate so this is the command to activate the virtual environment and this these are the two applications i'm uh, sorry these are the two pi files where you where you know you can uh, uh, you can you can check the code so this is the one of the file i called ml underscore backend dot pi where it can use uh, open ai as 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 a backend process uh, and and as i told you that you need to you need to add your key into this file and how we can create your key into open ai i will uh, i will show in the next video so this is how you can add your uh, like key in this uh, email uh, in in this particular code file and then after it will uh, you know work on the certain parameters attributes so you can change these attributes as well like uh, the maximum number of token the temperature the frequency penalty and uh, the maximum token so you you can uh, change all these attributes after uh, like as per your uh, understanding towards the code and uh, mm. these are the two main function where it 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 helps to generate the uh, you know content from open ai and it, it gets the response from uh, you know your choice of words uh, you can say your choice of text so this is the uh, first file and the second file is email dot app so in this it it's give you interface on uh, uh, you know it's it it's run on local as local host but it redirect to your chrome to your web browser and then after it will give you interface of uh, like email generator app and uh, like how we can uh, write your content into a into a particular box and then after it will give you uh, generated text and then after there is an also option to redirect to it uh, to 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 your uh, particular gmail uh, gmail app so 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 
let's get started and i'll show you how it it works so as i told you that i have already you know activate the virtual environment for this so now i i'm uh, you know running the pi files as this code is uh, built upon streamlight so like i need to type streamlight and uh, you know you can find as run as email app dot pi so for before that you need to install the requirement and for the requirement you need to add two dependencies as uh, open ai and streamlight uh, for streamlight you need to add additional subdirectories of uh, of this package uh, and secondly you need to install open ai so once uh, you you hit the command you will see a interface something like this email generator app uh, generate email email you want to to be written so let's say uh, here i'm writing as uh, write an professional email i'm so sorry professional email to my boss for two days leave so randomly i have you know type this maybe this is uh, not in correct uh, like format of english but let's say uh, because we need to test on every scenario of uh, you know text so that's why i have tested with the proper english sentence and uh, you know uh, without proper english sentence so for this like write an professional email to my boss for two days leave so like uh, this is the navigator bar like how many characters do you want to like to to add in your email so let's say uh, i will try to talk to a 500 uh, this this number is uh, totally custom customized uh, you can uh, you can add whatever the number you want to add and then generate email so like it, it it's take time to get response uh, from from the open ai and you can find this as this is written professional email to my boss for two days leave and this is the professional email so so like you can see on the screen so click me to send the email so when you hit on this uh, link it will re redirect to your uh, like gmail account as i am working on the guest uh, like guest type of uh, browsing but like if you have uh, sign in with your gmail account it will re redirect to your gmail application and then you can find you just need to add the uh, cc and bc uh, if you want to add or you can directly uh, mention the person whom you want to share this email with so this is the text this this was so perfect is but very helpful and easy to understand thanks a lot that was so perfect it was very easy and helpful to understand so uh, like uh, send your email so like something like this this will you know give you a brief about your email and uh, let's say if you want to if you want to reduce the number it will it will create an email how to five five characters in your email so like fix the permission on the image folder in my pc so i would suggest for that like if you uh, if you add a maximum number on this so it will give you a clear and uh, you know up to date content for for your input text So this is the content. Uh, you need to add, uh, or you need to edit some of the content as it it gets. Uh, it maybe you will get a noise content, but uh, 80 to 90 percent of the content are you know good to go with the with the correct English uh, formation and sentence creation. So this is uh, this is the current like workflow of this email generator app so as as i'm working on the guest um, like browser so it will not redirect me to the geek to the gmail app but in once you sign in with your gmail uh, credentials it will redirect to the gmail app so you need to all the like you need to only mention the uh, person with whom you want to share and then uh, 
uh, at the last you can uh, and then click on the send button so this is how it, it works and uh, so 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 if you have any like questions suggestions on this you can you can reach out to me or you, do, you can mention in the comment box and uh, yeah thank you so much for your time and i'll see you in the next video